Hello everybody, Brian here from quantlabs.net. Just wanted to introduce you to the harmonic patterns are now uh, working for my uh, cryptocurrency data feed for Binance. So if you come into my YouTube channel, Quant Labs, and just do a search for U uh, harmonics or harmonic, you'll be able to see all the difference in the uh, harmonic patterns uh, that I've talked about in the past. So um, we'll leave it at that. I'm not going to go into the introduction of anything here. Okay, so knowing all that, I'll show you what it generates. So in here, uh, in this particular folder, um, we can get, uh, maybe better to show it this way. We can get um, bullish and bearish, um, basically, patterns based on either usually hourly or daily so here you can see we've got a, a, a crab for Binance bullish uh, and here's the pair and the, and the and the frequency or the time frame of daily uh, same thing bullish crab pair uh, as well as the hourly time as well so I'm going to show you some of these um, so as I said, we have both bearish and uh, so we have all these bearish uh, looking patterns among our, so we have over 438 of those. Uh, we also have the bullish, which is another 481. But we want to break them down because I'm only, I don't know if you've seen my past recent videos I just put, put up concerning uh, the daily versus hourly. Um, I find that hourly is just too noisy. It's really hard to work with if you want to work with, particularly in this video, I show that. Um, it's a half hour video. Uh, and uh, actually, it might be this one just getting uploaded here. It's called Auto. Head and shoulders with other indicators reveal some algo trading among 300 plus crypto coins. So once that's rendered, you'll be able to, to see it, which doesn't take too long. Uh, so that's what we're dealing with. And as I said, I'm only interested in the daily, not the hourly. Okay, so we now are able to whittle it down to 60 uh, to 60. Um, charts so in that case let's get rid of this word count thing so now we have some random uh, charts here that we can look at so let me show you one just to show you what it looks like so in this case I'll look at this one bullish crab Binance this pair daily so basically all it shows is, is the complete pattern on what this is supposed to be looking like a bullish crab okay and uh, another one in this case I can show you an hourly a Gertley that one uh, also let me just show you maybe I think Gartley we showing you a uh, Gertley crab there's a butterfly um, and as an example what this looks like but you'll notice that the the pattern is completely uh, formed and then it'll tell you if it's bullish or not and it will also filter out all the ones that may be useful and then there's one more called the bat i just pull that up maybe sorry I'm on a little mouse right now but here's a bullish bat so based upon the pattern how it forms um, that's all historical. So that's all from that, that video, those videos I show you in my YouTube channel on the bullish versus bearish. So let me pull back up my list here of all the bullish and bearish. So what I'm going to do is I'll pull one of the, of the four. I'm just going to pull random ones. And what I want to show you is that the harmonic patterns are pretty close. I won't say 100% accuracy, but pretty, pretty damn close. I'm, I'm going to show you why uh, with the signaling between just a, a moving average cross. So in this case, I'm only, again, focusing on bullish uh, 
harmonic patterns and as well the only focus on daily patterns or daily time frames. So in my case, I'm going to look for uh, this one called X, Y, C, B, and B uh, daily. So this is the chart it's from. So I'm a little slow here because of the, uh, the uh, so let me just do this. Uh, so we want X, X, Z, C. Okay. So that's the B and B we want as well. So we're only going to focus on the daily yet again. So when I pull up that X, C, B, and B, yeah, that's what we want. B and B. So we want the the daily X, Z, B, one day right here. So that's the daily trend. So what you'll see, it's above trend. Now to confirm the signal, we just pull up the signals one. Again, this is all random, but I don't think this is a good opportunity. But in there, you'll see that there's probably a cross and at some point a signal will get um, generated. Let me pull up a better one. Let me pull up this one, uh, or WTC Ethereum. To be honest, I don't like it when they use these BNB base code, which is a Bin uh, Binance uh, coin. So let me just pull this up here. WTC ETH. Okay. So here we go. B is it you want Ethereum, sorry. WTC WTC. Okay, so let's go with the Ethereum. WTC Ethereum. Now again, this can all be automated. We're just showing you how to it's doing mechanically. So we want the daily WTC Ethereum trend. So it's in an uptrend. So what the signal says. So you can see here, right there, we get a signal. So that harmonic pattern in conjunction with this buy signal work together. And that's the sort of thing I'm looking for to confirm some sort of entry. So let me try another one here. Now I'm going to go into the bullish butterfly and see if we can pull up here. Uh, I'll pull up this one, the wing WTPC. So let me just see what we can pull up here. So we want W wing wing BTC again. Okay, so we want daily, daily, daily right here. Okay, it's in a downtrend, but it's still above the trend. But it's a in, in on short. Let me see what the signal says. Once again, here, not quite a good example, but mm, I don't know if I'd do that. But usually if you see a recent buy signal, um, that's something I will definitely want to do. So let's try this NEBL. Is it Nebula? I don't know. Nebula. And so I'm going to take my chances on this. So... This is the NLB, B, and B. So again, let's check out the trend here. The trend is down. What do we got here? So again, yeah. But usually you can, uh, the accuracy is really good if you can confirm it with a, uh, let's see the MTL, TL, BTC. MT Wow, without a mouse, I don't know how people can do this, but whatever. MTL, so we want this one, BTC daily. Let's hope this one works. So it's in the downtrend, it's above trend. So it's very close. So that might be something to watch out for. So it it's kind of works. Um, okay, let me show you another one 
for uh, let's try uh, uh, so we'd hit the bat let's try the crab bullish crab BTC okay so that looks like it's a bullish crab BTC US dollar so that, that might be an interesting one and that's, that's the granddaddy of them all so uh, BT C US dollar daily US dollar that must be it here okay so it's it, it's now back up looks like it's back up into an uptrend or could be let me just check on the signaling here Is it sell yeah I don't know but uh, let me try one more here because so it did check a bunch RDN okay RDN okay so we want RDN oops RD so that was RD RDN Ethereum RDN Ethereum signaling trend let's see what it says here it's above trend again the signaling see this is where the crosses happen and uh, um, that might be a signal to buy uh, but you can always compare uh, among other factors if it's worthwhile but you can see it's under value um, so it may be worthwhile okay one last pair I'm gonna look at uh, let me just look at the MCO the, now, remember these are all random MCO against Ethereum okay MCO Ethereum we just care about right now the trend uh, MCO Ethereum day trade that's the one the trend above trend the signaling again it looks like it could cross but it won't be I mean <laughs> it's not the return I would expect is pretty well pennies um, you ain't gonna make a living doing that but the reliability of this is pretty good common combined with the, the harmonic pattern and a bullish signal um, I could probably do one more um, Let's try this steam. Okay, steam against BTC. Steam. Don't forget we have the hourly as well. As I said, I wouldn't. So we're just coming up to the trend line here. Let's see what the signal says. Again, it's a down. But the very last bar is interesting. So that might mean it might have some momentum on the way up. So who knows on that. But um, I really don't think I'd do it unless I see an actual buy signal from the signals chart combined with, with the pattern. I don't really care what pattern it is, but um, as long as it's bullish. But it's quite interesting. But I thought I'd just share that with you. And should let you know it's available or it works or it's it's working. Talk to you later.